week to uh, catch our breath and uh, and get uh, get ourselves try to try to fix what we can fix in a short period of time. Uh, it's been really um, uh, good just for us to step back. We have unlimited hours. I don't think we've always done it. We got a light cleanup practice today, and uh, it's already done. So now we got a good well, over a day to rest. Uh, we'll, we'll still do some video and we'll do some some walkthrough stuff, and then it's 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 uh, all go uh, against Iowa. I'm no I'm no bracketologist or uh, follow the bubble like I once did, once did. All I did is know that this has to be an extremely important game for us if we want to keep our postseason uh, hopes alive. That or make a big run in the tournament. Anything can happen either way, but uh, it's easiest if you control your destiny and we beat Iowa and uh, puts us with 11 wins in our league and uh, hopefully that puts us in the right direction. John. Obviously not the uh, senior night that you might have envisioned for Karras and Spike, but uh, your thoughts on those guys going into this one? Well, it, it's a, it, they're really uh, uh, fine, and then I, I feel bad for them as well, that both of them, I mean, Spike played through um, you know, a lot of pain last year. The year before, uh, Spike got, was really sick at the end of the year when we were trying to make that run to the, to the championship game again. He, got, he was sick then, so he's, both of them have had a lot of adversity during that time. Do I to do it again? I, I offer both those guys scholarships. Those those three years, the parts of three years that they were able to give us is the total number of games they were able to give us. Um, were, were just incredible, fun to coach. Every time that you know, I don't see Karras in practice right now, but Spike, it's just like wow, he was really good. Brendan, you talk about the importance of this game. Uh, you know, these guys kind of had a week to think on it. Mm -hmm. Where do you kind of put them in terms of maybe not overthinking yeah. it, balancing it, but still playing with a sense of urgency? Yeah. I mean, every day that we get to practice, we, we, we're getting better. With, with this particular group, for whatever reasons, the, the learning curve is very slow. And so having extra time should help, but it doesn't mean, you know, what Iowa does, Iowa does with really a veteran team. And uh, it's going to be tough to stop them. It's going to be tough to score on them. They'll change things on us. We'll see zone, we'll see man. So I think we've made progress in that. Uh, but there, there is, you know, the thing that, that continues to bog us down is making do the same thing over and over again, the same mistake. So, but I've, I've seen, we've had a good week of practice. Anything particularly really stand out to you about this? I think our attitude has really been good all week. They know what's at stake and you know, the two days we, we really did the uh, Wednesday, Thursday, where we really practiced hard. We went over two hours. We just were into it. They, they didn't back down. They did a great job. Matt? What are your thoughts on Iowa kind of struggling here the last two, three weeks? Is there something you see that's going on there? Is it just, you know, you know it's a long season? season and people, uh, when you have this adversity like we've had that they've had, it's probably best to have it now. I mean, really, you see teams that will just have troubles at the end of the season, and all of a sudden March comes in one game, and they can they can go on a run. So they got that type of uh, senior class right now, and then Jock is playing as good as anybody in the league. And so he, uh, you know, I have to choose to turn around and say it could be a really good thing for them because they're definitely in the NCAA tournament. They got their resume done, but. Uh, you know, it, it's, they'll come in here, they're, they'll be, they're fighting for a seed, they're fighting for their own just positive uh, mojo. And we are, we're fighting like crazy for an NCAA birth, so it should be a great game. You talk, talked about leadership and as it's gone forward. You're talking about the bracketology and the importance mm -hmm. of the scheme. So are they talking about it? Do you hear them? Yeah. Is there something that, I, no, I, I wouldn't know that. I mean, I'm, I, try, I try to when we're off the court. I try not to talk to them about basketball that much. You know what I mean? It's just. I mean, in like meetings, a, are you guys putting yeah. on the board? Here's uh, no, no, something. I haven't done that. I, I, they know, but no, but I've talked to them about, okay, the Wisconsin game. You know, I, earlier I said we got four games, four games left or whatever. I said we got to win. You know, I, I feel we got to win 
two of these games or maybe three of these games and we got two teams on there and they don't have two teams that are really huge wins for you on the road at Wisconsin at Iowa. I think they figured that all out. Did you change the way you coach in terms of desperation in terms of minutes and rest? I mean, and they're in the middle of the game as a result of that importance. You know, I've, I've been looking at that and that's a good question. I think that what's really important is that um, we are we, we are um, not playing tired in the last 10 minutes. And so that's important to give them rest, some rest before then. So, uh, you know, I always felt the extra time out in the second half or the extra media time out in the second half, the longer one was always helpful to give a guy a rest. But I think I, I, I see some trends with some of our guys that down the stretch, either offense or defense, we'd like to give them one more break. Even if it's a two or three minute break somewhere in the second half, I think we've been doing a better job of getting everybody in there in the first half, but uh, our goal is to give them more. So I, I, I think I won't sh we won't lengthen the bench dramatically, but we may try and just get a couple minutes for a couple of our guys.